One person is dead after a multi-vehicle crash in Hacienda Heights this morning. Police say speeding may be to blame. It happened on the eastbound 60 freeway near Hacienda Boulevard. CBS News Car Finstrom reports from the a horrific scene on the 60 freeway in Hacienda Heights. A car went up in flames and the driver, who appears to have been an innocent victim, died. Now detectives are looking into whether the driver of the other car in Infinity was speeding. Investigators say the driver of the Infinity rear-ended a Toyota Camry right in front of that Caltrans truck, hitting it with such force that the two cars traveled about 100 yards before slamming into that wall. The Infinity's driver survived. Now detectives are looking into witness reports he was speeding and investigating whether a third car may have been involved. Sadly, the Toyota Camry bounced off the wall and across lanes of traffic before the driver died in the fiery crash. Officer Marcos Iniguez says a good Samaritan risked his own life to try and help. He tried to save the, uh, the driver's life that was in the Toyota Camry by trying to break the, uh, the window from the driver's side, trying to break that window out. Other drivers then stopped and brought out fire extinguishers, but could not reach and save the driver. At some point, the, uh, the engine compartment of that Toyota Camry started popping, and so he had to back away. And unfortunately, he, was, uh, he witnessed um, that, that driver perish. We do not yet know the name of the driver who was killed. Officer Iniguez told us the Good Samaritan he comforted after the crash was shaken and did not want to draw attention to himself but he was humbled by his actions. It's just extremely heroic that he tried everything he could up to the very last second. From Hacienda Heights, Cara Finstrom, CBS 2 News.